Hey everyone, in this video we are going to learn how you can automatically share your new Facebook page post to your Telegram channel. Here Facebook and Telegram are two different applications and there is no direct connection between Facebook and Telegram. That's why we are going to integrate both of these applications with the help of an integration software that is Pabli Connect. So that whenever a new post is created on Facebook page, Public Connect will automatically send message to Telegram at the same time. And you know what the best part is? This process requires no coding knowledge and any non-technical person can also do this easily. So let's begin with an example and learn the whole process. Okay, so this is my Facebook account and there is the page online class here. I'm going to create a post and here in the telegram this information group it will get posted directly. Okay, so here in the Facebook I'm going to create a post from here. Okay, so here your online classes of biologies are are scheduled on three July. Okay, now this is the post that I want to create. Now I'm going to post it. It took some amount of time while sending the response that means from Facebook to Telegram. So don't panic and wait for the response. Okay, now it is posted. Now I'm going to see my Telegram, that particular information group, whether we received the message about this post or not. Okay, so here in the Telegram. Okay. Okay, so here we have received the message, the link about this post. Okay, so that's how we have successfully connected Facebook and Telegram. Now how we did it, let's type pabli.com in the new tabs browser to learn the whole process. So here in the new tab, type pabli.com, P-A-B-B-L-Y.com, press enter. Okay. So this is the site of Pabli. Here we have to click on products and we have to click on connect. Okay, so this is a landing page of Pabli Connect. Here we have to click on sign in. As I've already created my account, that's why I'm directly signing in. You can also sign up for free just in two minutes with the help of this sign up free button. Now click on sign in. Okay, so this is the account of Pabli, of mine account. Okay, so here I'm going to click on connect access now. That's how you will reach to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here what we have to do, we have to create the workflow with the help of this create workflow button over here. So just click on this create workflow button. And here you have to name your workflow. So I'm going to give it name as Facebook to Telegram. Okay, now click on create. Okay, so this is the name of your workflow. Here I would like to mention that I will add the link of this workflow in the description box. You can directly clone it and directly access it into your account. Okay, so here whenever we'll click on create, these two windows will appear. This window is known as trigger window and this window is known as action window. You might be thinking what is this trigger action or trigger action window. So let me tell you whenever we talk about automation in Pabli Connect, it works on the concept of triggers and action. Trigger says when this happens, action says do this. Suppose in this use case, whenever a new post is created in Facebook, that will be a trigger and post it to Telegram will be action of this whole process. That's how we are going to make a connection. And here what we are doing, firstly, we are connecting Facebook to Pabli Connect and then Pabli Connect with Telegram. In this manner, we are going to make a connection. Now here in the trigger window, I'm going to choose application as Facebook. Okay, now here Facebook pages. Okay, now the trigger event is new post. Okay, now we have to connect our Facebook to public connect. So here I'm going to click on connect. Okay, now here add new connection and connect with Facebook page. Okay, so I'm already logged in. That's why it doesn't ask for the permission. But whenever you will connect it, it will ask for the permission for the access. So you can give access to Pabli. It is 100% safe. Okay, so here 
whenever it got connected there the page is visible page thing is visible this field is visible and this is page access token okay so let me go back to my facebook page and here i'm going back and here all the pages in my facebook page are visible okay so these are my facebook pages let me just show you again okay so this is pages and here all the page will be visible okay see all pages okay so these are the pages that are visible here and these same pages will be visible in this public connect that is my page any tech solution online class okay so here in this page section they all will be visible okay this is all will be visible so here we are going to choose one particular and i'm going to choose this particular online class page okay wonderful now this page access token it will be taken automatically so don't bother about it so you have to just choose the page in page in which you want to create the post okay so here i'm going to click on save and send test request but before that i'm going to make a post here okay so here facebook pages and here online class okay now here i'm going to create a post okay okay now here writing something okay so here you all are requested to join the online session of biology and chemistry by mr abhimanyu deshmukh okay this is the small post that i'm creating okay so here i'm going to post it okay now here in the public connect i'm going to click on save and send test request so whenever i will do this the recent post details will be visible here in this window how let me just show you okay so here we have got the response that means we have received the details okay so here we will receive the recently created post details okay so here is the post that is you are requested to join the online session of biology and chemistry by mr abhimanyu deshmukh okay so this is just a simply message over here and yes we are done with the creating post and we have successfully got the details from facebook to public connect now we are sending these details from public connect to our next application that is telegram okay so we have to send these details and for that we are going to choose an action application that is telegram okay here i'm going to choose it is telegram bot it works on the bot system okay so here telegram bot now action event action event is send text message or reply you can choose according to your requirement over here okay so here i have chosen this send um, send a text message or a reply so i'm going to connect it okay now here add new connection and here the token now from where you will get this token so let me just tell you you have to follow these steps i'm showing you this how to follow these steps okay so here in the telegram i'm going and here i'm going to search for bot father okay this is bot father and now here what you have to do you have to create a token okay for that firstly you have to type here as slash new bot okay now here it has given you the information and the details so let me just go it back okay so here what we have to do now we have to just let me just scroll it up okay so here we have to create the new bot okay so new bot again okay all right new bot how are we going to call it please choose a name for your bot so we have to choose a name for our bot so let me just choose it as v e v n okay and 1 2 3 now we have to choose the username by adding this suffix that is b o t bot or this particular bot okay so i'm going to add it as v 
n one two three underscore and this is bot okay now i'm going to send it okay so successfully we have got this particular token okay so this is the token that we require okay after creating this particular username what we have to do we have to just click on it and this is the username you have to make this username as a admin of your particular group so suppose i'm using this group so you have to add that particular user as the group member or admin of this particular group okay so here in this particular bot father just click on it and here you have to make it admin but i'm using telegram web that's why i am unable to do this you can do this on telegram desktop or on te mobile telegram okay so here for now i am unable to make this person as a telegram that's why i'm going to use my previous credentials okay so here i'm going to use it as let me just go back and have that token okay this one this is the token that i want to use now here in the public connect i'm going to paste it now save and we have successfully connected telegram bot with Pabli connect here what we have to do we have to fill these fields that is chat id text message okay so for that we are requiring this chat id to let me show you where we will getting this chat id from okay so here in the telegram web i'm going to search for my group that is information group okay so here this is the group i'm going to use and here this is the chat id okay so you have to select the particular group that in which you want to send the message and select the chat id of that particular group so just copy it and here in this public connect just paste it okay now one more instruction that here it is written that you have to follow these particular formats okay so if you are sending to group you have to follow this minus uh, format and this again if you are using for user you have to use this format and if you're using if you are sending the message to private channel then you have to use this format okay so that's how we are going to follow these formats so i'm going to send this in a group that's why i'm going to use it as minus before this chat id okay now here we are done with the chat id now text message now here all the details of the message or all the details of the post are visible here okay this is the message this is the message okay and here all the details are visible so here i'm going to map these details in this particular down window suppose we are going to type the message as new post okay and here we can type the message new post on here we can add the name of the group okay so let me just show you this is the name of the group okay so i'm going to show you where this is visible okay so this is the name of the group okay so we are going to add this in our text message field okay so here i'm going to map it okay from this drop down so i'm going to scroll scroll it down and here this is the name okay so full stop and here we can write the message directly okay so here it is the message let me show you the message so this is the message we want to add this in our text message field so how we are going to do it we are going to map it okay so here simply we can map it okay now here before this message if you want to add the link you can add the link to so yeah here before that we are adding link to okay so here i'm going to add any of the link from this like comment or share okay so you can use this one 
okay so i've added the link i have added the name of the page i have added the message okay so these are the three things that i have added in text message you can obviously add according to yourself okay so pass mode will be same disable notifications no i don't want to and disable link previews no so i'm done with the details here in this telegram window or telegram bot window that is action window now i'm going to click on save and send test request to send the response okay that means to send the details from facebook to telegram okay okay so the response received that means we have successfully sent the message to telegram group okay that is information group so now i'm going to check my telegram web and we'll see whether i have received the message or not so here in the telegram web okay so new post on online class so this is the link and you all are requested to join the session of biology and chemistry by mr abhimanyu deshmukh okay so this is the message that we want to send from telegram from facebook to telegram about the recently created post okay so here going back to public connect and here minimizing the windows okay so i'm going to summarize what we have done basically we have connected facebook with telegram okay so here firstly we have connected facebook to public connect and then we have connected public connect to telegram bot first we have received the details from facebook to public connect and then we have sent the details from public connect to telegram bot in this manner we have connected these two applications and not just these two software you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with public connect link of public connect and this workflow is given in the description for any queries contact us at admin@public.com a d m i n p a b b l y.com and if you really found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe our channel thank you so much for watching